my name is Steve Petromali. I'm a professional boxing trainer out of Los Angeles. Here is a guest trainer at the Get Top Team, one of the best MMA teams and camps in the world. And today I'm here with Rob Lucida, one of the best men, fighting out of his gym. And what we're going to work is defending the jab, how to parry the jab. So we're going to go right now. You ready, Rob? Yes, sir. Okay, so what I'm going to do is, when I, when I catch this jab, most guys reach for the jab. So throw the jab and they reach. And this is what they're taught. So jab, boom, and they reach. And if I reach, boom, he's going to count, he's going to faint that punch and counter me with a hook. You reach, reach, boom, and I'm going to catch him with that hook. So you never reach. So what I'm going to do is, we're going to go half speed just to break it down. Elbows in, hands up high. So he jabs, boom. And I use my step and I take that jab away. So go back, he jabs. Boom. And it's effortless, and I'm never out of position. And I'm still using my step. Jab. Boom. Go back. Hit me with a jab. Boom. Okay? Go back a little more so you got more range on your jab. That's actually a better place to throw your jab from. Now keep that hand up front, and you hit me with that jab. Boom. Okay? Now, we're gonna, you're going to work it. Okay, Rob? Remember, we're not going to reach. We're going to catch it as like you're catching the ball. Key is having that balance, and you're going to step and align it. And that's what catches that jab. Boom. Don't reach so far. Beautiful. See, there you go. Again. Excellent. Again. Nice. That's the way to take the jab away. Don't reach too far. You get counted with that hook, remember. There you go. See, you're stepping. You're in position. Again. Again. Good. Shuffle back. Very good. Very good. Now, this isn't flawless. This isn't going to be you'll never get hit with a jab. But this is the proper way to take a guy's jab away. When you take that jab away, you're taking away his main arsenal. That's his main thing in fighting. That's what he's working off of. Okay? So let's go again. Yep. No, I'm going I'm to jab you. Okay? Good. Don't reach. Now, nah, you just catch it again. Boom. Beautiful. That's how smooth it is. See, so you're using the step. Excellent. Again. Nice. Okay, now what we're going to do. Let's get in our stance. Just real quick, another good drill with this drill is the counter, okay? So, we're gonna go real slow. Rob always likes to go fast and ahead of me. But we're gonna bend the legs. And what he's gonna do, he's gonna jump real slow. And when I step, I take advantage of that. And I'm shooting over his head. Go back. This time, I'm gonna slightly touch him in the face, how I would do it. So again, boom, okay? Right there, so he goes, boom. And he's actually doing a good drill. I don't want you stepping with that front foot if you step. But just step with your jab. Boom. See how I come with that jab? He eats that thing right there and catches it. And believe me, after he catches a couple, he don't want to get hit. So what, what we're going to do now is instead of him jabbing in my face, he's going to shoot it over my shoulder. So, so I'll shoot it over his shoulder first. You jab. Boom. And I shoot it there. This way I get the extension. You don't want to pull it. Because if you pull it, you're not getting the, 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 the correct motion of stepping with your jab. Again. Boom. Okay? Again. Boom. Okay, let's go. Now you're going to block my jab, shoot it over the top. Good. Come forward. Nice, Rob. That's it. Get your hips down. Good. Excellent. Excellent. Keep that balance. Shoot. You're releasing that jab. Excellent timing. Excellent. All right. So that's how to parry a jab, not by reaching. Thank you. Mm -hmm.